Get paid, boy. What's up, guys? I'm Patrick here, and we are back with some more Bloodborne. This is just a continuation of the last video. I had to split it in two because it was getting a little bit too long. But uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the rest of the video with um, Patrick from the past. You can go there and there. What is that? <sighs> Bloodborne, why? 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 He is coming at me. Oh, right, see you later, boy. I'm running past you. <laughs> now I know there's no boss in this here, uh, in this uh, room right here. I actually didn't remember this guy from the speedruns. But I know I will have to come back here later on and I need to grab these, uh, this item right here in order to be able to progress later on. But yeah, that's uh, that giant thing. I don't know if I want to fight it, honestly. <laughs> Let's see, can I get a backstab on it? I will try. And if I can get a backstab, I will try and kill it. Otherwise, I'm just running past this guy. <laughs> yeah. I don't feel like fighting this guy. It does feel like unfair. He is huge. Alright. Slowly. I think I'm in range. Yeah, I should be in range. Yes! Game! Why? The game robbed me of my visceral attack. That is wrong. What was that? I don't think I can parry this guy. I think he just buffed. Yeah, do I want to fight the buffed version of this guy? <laughs> Not really. Alright, let's see what the Molotov will do to him. Ah, that's decent. Alright, let's get two more Molotovs on him. You know, just uh, run away. What is that? Oh, I guess that was his boss. So now his um, axe has got a lingering effect. Very fun, I have to say. Just commit. No, do not commit. Molotov. Oh, come on, mate. Just run at him. Whoa! Wow, the double hit is actually insane. Blood vials. Alright, thank you very much. I should have healed before picking those up. Yeah, this guy is quite powerful. <laughs> I wouldn't recommend fighting him. Especially because he only drops vials. That's not worth it. Alright, so this is the way to progress. I know that. And uh, what I'm going to try and do is uh, get to the next lamp or find the shortcut. Either one of those. And... Uh, then I will end the video because we are approaching 19 minutes so I want to keep these around 20 between 15 to 20 minutes long all right so I need to guess the timings here this, this is gonna work I see one gun right there so I might want to go there and shoot that one first is this gonna work yes it is gonna work and I see there's uh, one, two, three more. And I guess there's no more. That would be my guess. So if I go this way. That guy's gonna aggro. Yep. Yeah. Alright, I'm fine. And they are not shooting anymore. But they've got these pressure plates, I guess. Yeah. So if I push them, they will... Uh, they will shoot, me, shoot at me anyway. Alright. Oh, there's one more of them. Oh, I've seen you. I've seen that. What? Alright. I think the game is bugged. <laughs> From soft. Fix your game. It's been a while, so... Uh, I don't think that will. What is that? Freaking grenades. 
Yeah, I'm not having any of that. Get paid, boy. You and your torch. This guy with the freaking grenades. Bad one. Alright. Oh, another one. Die. Yeah, I see something I do not like at all. I hate those enemies. I just skipped them in uh, Kanehurst. Now I'm gonna have to fight them here because I, I would like to kill all of the enemies in this section, uh, in the DLC. I don't wanna skip enemies. Hmm, can't get there. I see someone walking up, but I wanna equip the torch. No, I don't have it. Oh, snap. Oh, the damage is quite... Oh, quite high, not gonna lie. Delayed Molotov. Alright, so that's the, the grenades I was talking about, I guess. Torch. We wanna have some uh, visibility in this place. Yeah, if I drop down, I'm not gonna be able to come back, so... Uh, Let's see what we've got in here. Who are you? Yeah, and I can I can come up here, through here. Okay. See an item. Why is he not dying? I don't know why, but I think this is a trap. There you go. I, I I knew that because this guy usually, you know, I used to farm him in... Uh, oh! He's still gonna explode. Boom hammer. Oh, let's see the boom hammer. What is it? I think this is the weapon that the guy was using. Can I try it here? Oh, I unequipped my saw cleaver. I shouldn't do that. That's actually pretty cool. So the transformation attack will boof, uh, boost my weapon with fire. And then the next attack. Oh wow. That's actually pretty cool. What is the scaling and all that? Let's see. C and E. I might give this one a shot. I will, I will have to check all the stats for all these weapons. How do they compare uh, with the soul cleaver? I will create a safe state and uh, go from there. Trying to unlock a shortcut of some kind. Oh no. No. Not him. Not again, anyway. Yeah, I'm not gonna get a parry on this guy. What about pushing him against the wall? That works. But he does dodge. I have to be careful. Oof, oof. No, no, no. Don't do any of that. Ah, that's not too much damage, actually. That's not too bad. Oh, I'm joking, mate. I was joking. Yeah, yeah, go away. I don't wanna do any of that. Can I get a parry, please? Pinning him against the wall works. But I need to be careful because... Um, he does dodge. Which means... That... Um, it's not going to be too effective. Every other hit is going to miss. What was that? So I think... The tactic for this guy is hit, transformation attack, hit, transformation attack. Because he dodges after every single attack. Firing hammer badge. Alright, that means I'm going to be able to buy some new weapons. Does this unlock a shortcut? It doesn't. Oh, that was useless. Come on, mate. I want a shortcut. <laughs> 
There has to be a shortcut to uh, to my lantern before the boss. Yeah, so I'm gonna go back. And this way. So I can grab that item. What is it? Old Hunter Top Hat. Ooh. That sounds even more interesting. Ooh. I like that. There's a door right there. There's the bridge. Yeah, I'm just looking around how to get to the shortcut. That's, uh... It looks like a place I should be able to go to. Yeah, because I'm gonna use the blue elixir. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not gonna mess with these guys. Not just yet. I do not feel comfortable doing that at the moment. See ya. Oof. Oh, that's not too much damage. Blood vials. Thank you very much. Ooh. Ooh. You are weaker than your friends. That's fine. What about these guys? And you? Still no shortcut. Oh, I managed to grab those blood files. Oh, there's one more of you. Oh, cheers, man. Thank you for dying. Alright. Let's see. Anything in here? More enemies. Wow! I don't remember the ones from uh, Kane has spitting like that. That's uh, interesting. Alright, some gloves we don't really care about. <laughs> yeah, where's the shortcut, mate? It has to be this way. There's an NPC. Alright. Who are you? You're a hunter with your sanity, aren't you? Must have taken a wrong turn, then, eh? Well, we're more alike than you think. This is the hunter's nightmare. Where hunters end up when drunk with blood. You've seen them before. Aimless, wandering hunters slavering like beasts. This is what the poor fools have to look forward to. So, don't be brash. Turn back before it's too late. Unless you've something of an interest in nightmares. Oh yes, I see. You sense a secret within the nightmare and cannot bear to leave it be. As if the spirit of Bergenworth lives on within you, such inquisitive hunters will relish the nightmare. But beware. Secrets are secrets for a reason, and some do not wish to see them uncovered. Especially when the secrets are particularly unseemly. Beware. All right. So that is his dialogue, and I recognize this door. This is the door that usually leads to the upper cathedral ward, and yeah, it is the shortcut. I was right. I think that's gonna be it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. I am actually having quite a lot of fun because it's not easy. Uh, the DLC is quite uh, challenging, especially I don't know because I don't know what to expect. But yeah, this one's going to be a longer one. I hope you guys enjoyed and yeah, I'll see you in the next one.